wants to be a mathematician, I have a quick story. I was at, I'm, I'm on a board and we had a dinner down in New York City. I'm sitting next to a nice woman and we're chit-chatting. I said, well, what are you doing the coming weeks? She said, we're going over to Holland because my husband's building a boat. I said, oh, how nice. Uh, power boat? She said, yes, power boat. I said, how big? She said, it's 300 feet. And I said, that's a big boat. She said, yes, my husband's been very successful and that's the only thing he splurges on. And I said, well, how's he been successful? And she said, well, he's a billionaire. <laughs> and uh, I said, how did he get to be a billionaire? And she said, he was a mathematician. So, who wants to be a mathematician? <laughs> and his name is James Simons, and he started a hedge fund. And before coming over here, I looked him up, and I think now he's worth $10 billion. So, who wants to be a mathematician? Everybody. Uh, and that's how he got to be successful, using his math formulas uh, uh, to do financial studies. So, I wish you all the best, and I know it's, uh, you've worked hard to get here, and uh, certainly here in the state of Rhode Island, we want to continue to support education in all capacities, particularly in science education and mathematics. And look forward, we're very proud to have the American Mathematical Society in Rhode Island. So, uh, pleasure to join you.